Holly Valentine, I was placed in jail under a suspicion of stealing someone's bag, even though I did not take the bag, and there's no proof that I stole the bag. They never found the bag on me. Um, I also, you know, got in the guy's car, went around the corner, brought it back. Oh, it he said it. Was, he said it was fine. The cop thought otherwise. I got charged with grand theft auto and a seventy-five hundred dollar fine. And I've been in these handcuffs for around 30 minutes. Pretty insane. Um, if I remember correctly, you were seen in the weasel footage taking the car and then bringing it back. And then just minding your own business. So basically nothing happened other than you leaving and coming back with the car. That is correct. And the... No bag was found no bag. in my car. They searched my car as well without me giving consent. Um... As well as the guy whose car it for it was, he told the officer that it was fine, told him that we uh, we came to an understanding, but the officer still, you know, impounded my car before before my charges were even placed, before I even got in the cop car, he called someone over to impound my car, and yeah, then he arrested me and brought me here. When I, I just want to say when I first got in here, I did say I wanted to talk to my lawyer, but they never contacted my lawyer for me. Lawyer. Um, I did. They didn't respond. Oh, well, you could have told me that. I just feel like this was unfair completely, and the cop, you know, didn't do his job right at all. Even the guy said that I had permission to take his car, but the cop thought otherwise for some reason. And was even threatening to arrest the guy. Uh, because he quote unquote lied to the cop about me stealing his car. He still ended up here. Cry a little. Ollie, if you could tell the police officer who arrested you one thing, what would you say? You made my kids not eat tonight, sir. <laughs> oh. As I have $7,500 in fines now. <laughs> he has kids. Make sure you know the right street. Do you have kids, Max? Are you guys all just simp for that one girl in your gang? I mean, I'm not in a gang, sir. I don't know why you yeah. assume that. What about your last name? What? How many other Valentine? Have are you assuming that my last name is a gang? Yes. No, we're a family. What's wrong with your gang? Like what? Like Fast and Furious? Oh, it's not like we do anything illegal. We don't. You're in prison. Are you in prison? In prison wrongfully. Wait, Molly. Didn't we just hi didn't I just hire a cop? I, Ali, are you related to Bobby? Hey, what's up? I'm related, related to, to Bobby. Bobby. I love Bobby. Oh, it is is he a, in a gang? Oh, we're not in a gang. I I literally okay, I, okay. I will swear over anything. There's no incest going on between the Valentines. That's all I gotta say. Sometimes, sometimes it'll just be brotherly love by kissing each other. Okay. Actually, I hope you got that reference. Okay. I, just, I saw a lot more and heard a lot more than just kids. Hey, Yuki. What did you just say? I just said there's not enough Asians in this world. Or it's in this city. No, I, 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 I understood what you said. Don't say what I don't say. We're not incest. Asian. I swear to God. We're not Asian. <laughs> no, the one I'm country Japan. that can't do incest? From. We're fr we're from That's Japan, true. but we're not Chinese. Oh, so you were just born in Japan, but you're not actually Asian? Yes. I just thought you were black Asian. I'm not gonna lie. I don't this is racism! Hello? How Record is, this! You're African, African American. Since you were born in Japan. I've got this thing you... about racism. Yeah, you just said you were born oh, in Japan. Can I, I also, can I also mention the fact that, that like, a few Japan. hours ago when I was in here, Bill... Bill was very racist to me when uh, we were in the cell block. Lies. That's not true. So. Mm. Okay, well, that wasn't that <laughs> wasn't no, an unfair no. thing. Actually, you know what? It was like Ali didn't even leave. You know, he was in the cell block. I went to go do a firearms training. And then I showed back up and he was still there. But apparently it was just for a different reason. Well, yeah. See, the thing is, I literally just got out of DLC. So why would I do something illegal as soon as I get out? Do you have a track record of committing stupid crimes? Nope. Not me. I'll leave you people to it. Enjoy. Yo, I, I would like to mention the part where Bill was racist to me earlier. I was in here. Oh. 
So yeah, he's gonna deny it. But so I would like to state what he it. did. So he's he told me that I grew up on the streets because I no, am black. A street, a street. No, no, no. He it's said I grew up on the insta. street. So I, hello. So I asked him what his name was, and I couldn't understand his last name. So he is, he goes street like you know the streets you grew up on because you're black. Yes, I did not say that. That's not true. You're definitely. To inquire, uh, Cobb for some extra footage to see if he's got any. Pink Gentlemen, is there any other comments any any of the three of you'd like to make before we end this recording? No, sir. Um, are you guys never on duty when I need blips? Uh, you see, we had a...